Hey, Zons and Zebas. This is the Frugal Diva, your hostess with the mostest. In any case, today is Friday. I'm supposed to do a rant, but I'm really not doing a rant. So I decided to do a Bath and Body Works candle haul. And I'm going to tell you how instead of getting three candles, I ended up getting 12. And I'm going to do a whole bunch of rambling in the beginning like I'm doing right now. So if you really don't want to hear that, go to like maybe like 440, 450. And most likely all my rambling to be done. Mm -hmm. Let's get started. Hey, dogs and divas, frugal diva, frugal diva, what, what, frugal diva, Southern Charities Bakery, Southern Charities Bakery, yes, dogs and divas, today is Friday, and it is time for another frugal diva, but I don't even exactly know what the heck I'm going to rant about, so I guess in the middle of this, I'm going to rant for the Friday rant, but however, Wednesday, I was supposed to put up a video, I'm supposed to put up videos on Wednesday, uh, which is kind of like, uh, like bad stuff and things that, that nature is, whatever's on my mind, whatever the heck, you know, for Wednesday, but I didn't do it, so I'm doing it today, and I did go to Bath and Body Works, nothing inside of this bag, so I took it out already, so that way I can show y'all, but yes, I went to Bath and Body Works, now, yesterday I saw online that they had the 10 for 30, uh, coupon, uh, so I was like, okay, fine, yes, I'm gonna do that, so I was looking online, I was like, okay, let me see, you know, what I could get from online, and then I saw that they had candles for $10, not all the candles, like they had previously, about a month ago, not all the candles, but um, certain candles, like the the summertimey candles, where you know, basically they 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 dupes, they they rename it for something summertime, and it's actually something, it's another uh, candle, or whatever the case may be. We're not gonna go here, anyway. So I was like, yes, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into the store because I hate paying for shipping. I have, I think I told y'all that before. I hate paying for shipping. If I don't have to pay for shipping, I'm not paying for shipping. I'm like no, especially what, not with Bath and Body Works when I have three that I can um, go to. But anyway, so I said I'm gonna go inside the store. I'm gonna get three of those ten dollar uh, candles. I'm gonna use that ten for thirty, which is gonna bring it down to twenty dollars. Plus, I had a ten dollar e gift card because of me not getting my order, my online order that I made about two or three weeks ago. Me not getting it happened, and it happened to be replaced, and then one item not being there, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I'm going to uh, link that video right here. So, in any case, um, yeah. So, I, and I also didn't show y'all what I actually got. I only got two items, so I, I know at some point in one of the uh, videos I will do that and show you what, the, what that is. It's kind of quick, whatever, whatever. So, because this video is gonna be. I'm trying not to make it long, but I do have mm, 12 candles to show y'all. Yeah, I said 12. No, not 3. 12. I have 12 candles to show y'all. So, the reason why I have 12 candles to show y'all is because when I got one online. I got my 3 candles. The $10, can $10 candles and stuff like that. I got my 3 candles. And I got one online. But then when I got to the front of the line and was getting ready to up make my purchase, a lady had uh had some candles and she had put them to the side because she was going back to get some other stuff or whatever the case may be. And I noticed that they were the uh, smaller candles. The ones that are uh, $10. Not the long, not, not the, the medium ones, but the ones that are like, you're going to see. But anyway. So those ones that are $10. So I'm sitting here like, why? And my mom, I'm like, why is she buying $10, these small $10 candles when she could get some um three wicks for $10? I mean, I know it's got to be at least one or two, three wicks of the uh, of the three wicks that are for $10 that you want to, uh, that you have to wear. But anyway, whatever. So, so I'm saying, ask the sales associate about that because she got like, she had like six of them. So I asked the sales associate, I said, um, are these candles on sale? She said, oh yeah, they're 75% off. What? I said, okay, uh-uh, well let me put these candles, let me put these candles right here to the side. We're going back here to um, go and see. And I went back there and I saw, and that's how I got 12. What, 12 candles instead of 3 candles. So, so let's get started. Because obviously that was long enough. So let's get started. So the first candle I'm going to show y'all is going to be Oa Coconut Sunset. And as you see, see the size of this candle. It's the medium candle. But it's the little round, the, the round ones. The ones that they normally uh, put out um, for testers for the wallflowers. For you to smell it. You know, smell the wallflower. Whatever case may be. Smell it through his. And these are normally those candles that they put out. And normally when they have the semi-annual sales is when normally when they start when they sell them. So in any way, like I said, Oluha um, Coconut Sunset. And it says, relax at the end of the day with a sunset. Inspired blend of coconut blossoms and exotic tiger lily warmed by molting umber. Oh yes. And you can just smell the coconut. It just it's just coming through. Like, oh my gosh, let me take that light and put that to the side so that way it's that light is killing it. Yes. And the next one is also a coconut one. And this is guava, 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 guava pina colada. Pina colada. You know that dyslexia kick in. Like, see here where it says try me on the top? Yeah. So this is normally, these are normally the candles that they have out for you to smell because you can't actually 
really smell the um the wool scents, the uh wool flowers. Oh god, it smells so now this one does not smell just like that. It doesn't smell like the other one. Oh my god, they, they both smell wonderful. But I actually like the aroma of this one. I can smell the guava coming through with the uh the coconut. So in any case, this is the perfect answer to a hot sun hot sunny day. The fragrance of freshly picked guava, creamy coconut milk, and orange flower. Yeah. Okay, now this next one is Honey Crisp Apple. Oh gosh. But now I'm, oh I don't know, I don't, I don't know what to do. I didn't know what to do, y'all. Honey crisp apple. Now this is I'm gonna be clipping on and off that uh thing. The uh like golden honey crisp, apple blossom, and fresh sugar cane. You can really smell the apple, like a fresh picked apple, but you can smell that sweetness of the sugar cane also. This is going to be crazy. This is going to be crazy. I don't feel like moving around, whatever the case may be. So y'all going to have to just work with me. Now this is Form Stand Apple. Form Stand Apple. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, y'all. I don't know what to do. This is just... And I don't feel like redoing this video. So, y'all got to work with me. Y'all just have to work with me. Okay. Form Stand Apple has um, Macintosh Apple, palm, Palmy, Macintosh Pear, Pure Oak, and Chini. Chine? 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 I don't know. C-H... E N E with a little ampersand kind of thing on the top. Sh sh Shani, Shani, I don't know, I don't know. But this smells just like a crisp apple. It just smells like a crisp, fresh, crisp apple. Okay, I don't. Okay, that's what we're going to have to do. So now this one is Peach Bellini. Peach Bellini. Oh my gosh. And I already knew this was going to smell wonderful. Like, I'm going to tell you, some of these, I just picked them up and just, just, just picked them up and put them in my, uh, put them in my uh, bag because, I mean, hey, you can't beat, you can't beat the price. I paid, the most I paid was um, $2.12 for a candle. Some of them was $2.12, some from some of them was $1.76 after the, you know, all that discount. Anyway, a shimmery holiday twist on a classic blend of white peach, tart, black, black currant, and a splash of juicy orange. I really don't smell any orange. I smell mostly just the peach. But, um, hey, it smells wonderful. Wonderful. Next. Next, this is a Georgia peach. A Georgia Georgia, my man, Georgia, Georgia Peach. Now this one doesn't smell just like the last one. I actually like the last one, the other peach one better. I like the smell of this, but I like that one better. Hint nodes, okay. Nothing, wait a minute, there's nothing sweeter than a blend of Georgia Peach. Dew covered leaves and a hint of creamy vanilla. Okay, I don't really smell the vanilla. I really truly don't. And I'm and after reading the scent note. From the scent note, I 
I thought I from the scent notes, I would think that I would like this one more than I like this one. From the scent notes. But I actually like this one more. Maybe because even though I don't smell the orange in that orange juice, juice, juicy orange, or whatever in that one, but I am a my top scent or citrus scents so maybe that's what's coming to my nose even though i don't smell it it may i may smell it without smelling it you know y'all get what i'm saying anyway okay lemon cell lemon cello pop tail pop tail oh baby that lemon is just like boom yes i love it and i love i, I mean i love the smell of citrus i love citrus Oh gosh, I love it. Okay, sweet and zesty lemons, Italian lemon, lemoncello, liqueur, and sparkling sugar blend into an amazing citrus fragrance. They ain't never lie. An amazing citrus fragrance. Woo! Look, made my eyes cross. <laughs> anyway, uh, next. This one is fresh balsam. Now this one right here, I had a small one, and the reason I picked this up first of all, I like the smell of the fresh balsam, but I picked this up because I had a really small one, like those ones that's like four fifty. I didn't, I know I didn't pay four fifty for it, but but that's how they, you know that's how much they regularly cost the, the little the little ones four fifty, and I picked that up, and it wasn't this color, it wasn't white. I remember it being like a green kind of color. But in any case, it smells just like that one. And boy, oh boy, I'm happy to have this because, like I said, I had that little small one. And I had used it. I used it at work and it's gone. It's done. Oh, God, it smells so good. Okay. This is an evaporating. Oh, invigorating. Ev invigorating. Evaporating. <laughs> that dyslexia, I tell you. The... The invigorating aroma of evergreen woods on a clear fall morning morning features crisp 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 eucalyptus fe, fe, crisp eucalyptus fear needles and see Cedar wood musk notes. Let me read that again. Because boy did I butcher that up. Okay. The invigorating aroma of evergreen woods on a clear full morning features crisp eucalyptus, fair, fair needles, and cedar wood musk notes. Woo. Oh, that smells so good. Oh my gosh. And I love the smell of cedar and... And sandalwood and all that. Oh my gosh, and oak. Mmm, yes, yes, yes. Next. This one is cucumber melon. Now, if you have not seen my video, which I said I already, I'm already uh, attaching that video. If you have not seen my, my video on the, um, First uh, items that I got from the semi-annual sale. Animal. Animal sale. The semi-annual sale. Then you don't know. My obsession. My love of cucumber melon. This was my first fragrance I ever got from Bath and Body. Ugh. And it, it brings back such wonderful memories now this is cucumber melon a crisp blend of refreshing cucumber and a sweet honeydew touched with jasmine and muget okay okay my all-time this is my first all-time favorite and then then my next then then my next after that is um warm warm Vanilla sugar, warm sugar vanilla. But this is my top, and this is my first fragrance I ever got from Bath and Body. Yeah, I said that story in there. And every time I, every time I get something cucumber melon, I'm going to kind of say that story. And it is what it is. Y'all got to work with it. 
Okay, this is champagne toast. And I have champagne toast in a three-wick candle, which I have not burned yet. And I don't have to burn the three-wick candle now, because now that I got this one, I'm going to burn this one first. Oh, my gosh. I'm definitely taking this one to work. Oh, yes. I'm taking this one to work because I just, oh my, it just smells so wonderful. It does, it just, it does, it smells like champagne, bubbly, okay? Yes, okay. Oh, okay. Champagne, champagne. <laughs> it says it's white. Champagne, champagne, wild berries, bells, sauvage, sweet orange, an orange secure. Oh, it just smells. It smells wonderful, guys. Anyway, moving on. Moving, 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 moving on. Um, moving, moving, moving on. Um. Oh gosh. This is sparkling sugar plum. Sugar plum. Sugar plum fairy. Another one I'm going to definitely take to work. I think I'm going to have this one and the champagne toast. Those are the ones that are going to be my summer. Yes. Yes. Those are going to be my summer lovelies in my office at work. Okay. Visions of this beautiful blend of sparkling sugar plum, apple blossom, and a touch of mint will dance in your head. I don't smell really any mint at all, but baby, this is dancing in my head. I guess if I really, really suck it in, I can kind of smell the mint, I guess. I don't know, but baby, this smells so good. This, this also smells like, this smells also like champagne, like something, like something you would drink. Oh my goodness, this smells like, oh my gosh, like a wine or champagne or something, yes. And last but not least, we have mahogany cotton, mahogany cotton. And this is a very robust, kind of manly uh, aroma. So I know it's going to have a hint note somewhere, musk, got it, because it's a robust kind of scent. Oh wow, mahogany Asaju white cotton, cotton blanc, spring air, spring air, mm -hmm. spring air, air, air prisoner, air prisoner. What the? F <laughs> ah! I was getting ready to cuss because I'm like, what the hell is that? Air prisoner. What is that? Printer. Printer. What the heck is air printer? What the what is that? Like an air freshener? I don't know. I'm surprised it doesn't say the word it doesn't say musk. I guess the mahogany is the musk. I don't know, but I'm surprised it doesn't actually outright say musk. Because it does have a nice, wonderful, manly, musky aroma. Like I said, that was the last one, right? Yes. That was the last one. Uh, what am I going to rant about? I don't know. Let me tell, let me just tell y'all. Oh yeah, I, I had a rant from last week, but you know what? I'm not even going to think because this video has been long enough. All I'm going to say is, for my rant, all I'm going to say is, I don't like when people take your kindness for weakness. People who are kind and humble <clears throat> are the worst people to really mess with. Because kind, humble people, when they get to that breaking point, when they get to that straw that broke the camel's back point, they like hell on wheels. Okay, they're like hell on wheels. Because they boiling and bottling all that stuff up. And when they burst, that's it. Let me just tell you, 
I'm, you know what I'm going to say this. Pressure. Pressure. Pressure do two things. Pressure bust pipe and make diamonds. So when you put somebody under pressure, you better hope that you get a diamond and not a bust pipe. Because if you get a bust pipe, I guarantee you they're going to bust. Anyway, Dawns and Divas. Have a further diva day. Hey, Dawns and Divas. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. If you are subscribed, make sure your notification bell is turned on. And if you have any suggestions for videos you'd like to see on this channel, leave them in the comment section. Also, leave your comments about this video. I do reply. But if you come for me, I will trump you. And if you don't know what trumping is, watch one of my earlier videos. As always, smooches, dons and divas, smooches!